Yo, 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 what's up, everybody? Silky Creamy in the house. Back for another video. Appreciate you guys stopping by. If you're new, welcome in. My name is Silky Creamy, and I do niche videos on shaving soap and uh, shaving aftershave uh, and other things at time to time um, in regards to uh, skincare products. But today, and for those that are... Um, are here again uh, again thank you i appreciate you um you guys are the ones that keep me going and so anyway today we're going to be doing a special one and this one is uh again from sphinx beard um again a company that it was uh, i think made their name known um via the beard oils um but i now began to branch out into uh shaving soaps and aftershave splashes and so um as always with background just to speed things up on this video the base is kaizen it's made by peter Sharkalis and ariana evans it's going to be a great performing base um argue definitely top five base in the in the world right now um it is going to give you a um just an incredible uh shave and um you're gonna not gonna have any problems with it unless you are vegan of course so uh, but then again, you probably won't be trying this if you are vegan. Uh, but anyway, um, this is Caribbean Island. And so um, I had um, accidentally ordered two sets of this um, <laughs> because I had ordered it when I was lying in bed and um, not really paying attention and going through and hitting add cart and I guess I hit add cart twice for this particular scent. Um, and so I had sent out the um, the soap uh, to IMCBB um, as he, you know, it was an extra one I had and he was interested in trying it. So I sent him the tub and he did a video and um, I'm going to put in the links um, of this video or in the description, the link to that video um, so you can get his take his professional take on this scent um, and also see how it performs on on the face when you lather it but um this is a um and he thought it was a really nice scent um he compared it to saint bart's uh from ariana and evans uh he thought ariana evans saint bart's was a little bit strongly scented more you know strongly scented than this one um so that's just an fyi uh, it's a little background on this scent, but as always, we shall go through it and uh, give you uh, my take on it. And so basically, again, Sphinx Beard. I love these lines. Just make it really, really cool. Very clean. I like the typewriter type font. Um, and again, in classic fashion, it'll have the scent here and then the Kaizen. Again, this is a four ounce sub, $23. Um, this is your Kaizen ingredients. And if you don't know what Kaizen base is, feel free to take a snapshot or a screenshot of this and take a look at it. Uh, from the back, this is what it looks like. So from a color perspective, we're looking more on the lighter side. So I'm leaning towards citrus and towards um, floral. Um, that's kind of like my, what I've learned rule of thumb. Uh, looking at the color of the base will kind of give me an idea what kind of scent we're looking at. It's not always true, but it's a pretty good um, idea. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look, folks. Boom. Lovely color. Really, really nice um, pour on this one. As always, from Kaizen. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Look at that. I just love the look of um, Kaizen. And then true fashion with Kaizen, you've got these like ripple effects that lead to some cratering. Um, really, really, really nice. Look how, um, you can see how the fat, um, this is really going to, you know, Kaizen is really going to be a great, uh, lather for you. Anyway, 
super super nice really really great look again this is probably going to be on the softer side it's actually not bad it's a bit firm uh, but definitely soft as you can see stuff come off uh, first scent hmm All right, so as you would expect from Caribbean Island, I am picking up uh, pineapple. I'm not really picking up much coconut. There may be coconut in here, but it's definitely not forward. It's very fresh. Um, it's got a tropical vibe to it, as you would expect from Caribbean Island. Um, Sense strength on this, I would again consider this a five. So I've been noticing with Sphinx Beard um, with their shaving soap that uh, they're in the medium range, you know, my five to six. But let's go ahead and let's read from the website. Uh, Caribbean Island inspired by Creed's Virgin Island Water. Interesting. Opens the door to a beautiful tropical world filled with juicy tart limes dusted with sugar dripping in coconut milk with just a touch of spicy rum to make this beach cocktail a perfect vacation for the senses. So the notes are coconut, lime, white rum, and sugar cane. And in quotes it says, beard, you call it facial hair, I call it awesomeness. Interesting. Um, so I kind of, to me, I picked a pineapple. Maybe I just assume pineapple. Um, but I didn't really pick up the coconut, and now, I mean, I don't know if it's because of the coconut milk is is having um, is masking um, some of the scent oils. But you know, I don't really pick up much. I do kind of see the lime very little bit, but I don't pick up any um, like sugar. I don't pick up rum. I don't pick up um, coconut. Um, but it's a very fresh scent. Um, I don't know. Maybe when you lather it up, you're going to be getting those notes. But yeah, this is Caribbean Island. So yeah, maybe if you lather it up, it's going to give you those um, coconut, lime, and rum, which sounds like a really great uh, um, um, extra. So anyway, we're going to go ahead and smell this. After shave for Caribbean Island and see how it comes out. Hmm. I pick up more of the lime on this. More lime on the after shave. So, um, yeah, Caribbean Island Sphinx Beard, twenty three dollars fifteen. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, really really um so far the scents have never been off um from for me from sphinx never any misses um i just wish some of them were more strongly scented again can't go wrong can't really complain this is a good product um and um yeah so make sure you take care of each other out there folks all right let's be nice to one another and let's bring people up and uh let's not bring people down have a safe summer um, sent on, brothers and sisters. Peace and aloha.